So today I'm with Mark Sisson, who's a co-founder of NanoTouch Materials. Mark, how are you today? Fantastic. Glad to be here. So where does the world find you? Well, we are in central Virginia, um, nice rural part of uh, Virginia. Um, I actually live on a farm. So um, it's great to be able to do uh, this kind of high-tech manufacturing and live the uh, rural lifestyle at the same time, especially with the pandemic. Yeah, you get to walk outside and get some fresh air without a mask, unlike some other people. (laughs) Well, it's good to have you on our program today on Straight Talk. Uh, We're going to talk about your technology just so people can be aware of of what you're doing for the industry. So NanoTouch Materials is about self-cleaning surfaces. Now, that's that's interesting because if you could if you had something that would clean my dishes and clean my floors, (laughs) I would probably buy that product. But uh, let's just let's get right to it. Tell us about what you guys do. So uh, about eight years ago, we we had this idea of creating um, cleaner surfaces um, that that didn't use a lot of toxic chemicals and 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 other kind of toxins. We wanted to do things using technology rather than toxins, is what we say. Um, so after a lot of research, um, we we got a two million dollar research and development grant, which allowed us to develop the science, work with the materials, and create um, really a full line of products uh, from a prototype standpoint. Um, And so we did that over the last eight years and just came out of research and development at the end of last year, ready to go to market. And then, you know, the pandemic hit and kind of all bets were off at that point. So we went from three people being funded by that grant to uh, 20 people in a period of about three months. Well, congratulations on that. Uh, I I know that with ISSA, you have a couple of products that won the Innovation Awards in the past. We did. In 2016 and 2017, we we were really curious about the market. We knew we had an interesting product line that we thought would be very beneficial for the commercial cleaning and Jansan facility management kind of market. Um, just producing cleaner spaces where we all, you know, work and, um, and play. So tell us about this one. How does it work, this, this self-cleaning surface technology? Yeah, so we, um, one of the heavy lifters is a mineral nanocrystal that gets charged by any visible light. Um, and it creates a very powerful oxidation reaction that continuously breaks down any organic contaminants on the surface. So uh, because it's a catalyst, nothing's released from the surface. It regenerates its oxidation reaction continuously. And as long as it's not physically worn, um, really that determines the lifespan, uh, that oxidation reaction will go on forever. So it's really, we, we say it lasts about 90 days and that's purely from physical wear from you know, hundreds or thousands of touches. So if I have a facility and I want to implement your technology, what do I need to do? What's it going to look like? So we we created a really interesting diagram um, specifically for facility managers that show a kind of a drawing of a building, your typical commercial facility, all the different areas in that facility, conference room, bathrooms, kitchen, all the places people go and um, and showed the different products that we've developed for those high traffic touch points and specifically which product they would want to apply to that touch point. And so that helps them go on our online store, pick the appropriate products for their facility. And then after that, it's, it's a simple matter, matter of uh, peeling and sticking the uh, skins to the different touch points. Okay. So it's a direct application product, it no is. equipment that's going to be working or no, very low skill set to install and replace, just really peel and stick. Um, and, and one of the key things that we found accidentally, we, you know, we developed this for what it does, create cleaner touch points. But what we found was a lot of people weren't buying it for that reason, not buying it for what it did, but for what, how it made people feel. So we started talking to facility managers who were saying, The fact that I can see or my tenants in the building can see the cleaner places to touch because it's visible provided a peace of mind and a positive, you know, effect on perception of tenants in a building. 
and that added real business value to those facility managers. Mm -hmm. So where can people see demonstrations of this? Are there videos you have or a resource center? We, we've got, if you go to nanoseptic.com, um, you can see our products, what industries we serve, kind of give a, we try to give an overview of in each industry, how they're applied and, and kind of where the value proposition is for each industry, because sometimes they can be a little different. Um, and then obviously the online store shows the full line of products and, um, and how they're packaged. Yeah, I think those watching this today will probably need to see that to get a full understanding, but this is great information. Um, I tell you what, Mark, if you ever come up with a self-mowing grass application, <laughs> I definitely am interested in that as well. So, Sounds good. Well, thank you for your time today. Appreciate it.